let's discuss the benefits of the Scarabius. In plain language, improved product quality. The Scarabius process creates higher quality pellets, which can be sold at better prices due to significant tighter pellet size distribution and higher iron ore content. The Scarabius pelletizing disc gives the operator a full range of influencing parameters by the machine itself. In the end, there's no need to add more and more binder and additives only to create better pellets, higher strengths. The equipment could do the job. Let's get on the disc and discuss the influences of the parameters, rotational speed, inclination, rim height, beside other influencing parameters like the position of the scrapers, like the inclination of the scrapers. Come with me, please. Next to the pelletizer, I would like to discuss several influencing parameters with you. But before we have to get in mind, 150 tons per hour of material flow over that rim. 150 tons of material, iron bearing, fine particles get into the process chamber, get wet by the addition of water, and in the end, due to the rolling effect of the pelletizing disc, the material grow. Grow until the rim is over, we could say. And in the end, the balls roll over the rim of the disc onto the discharge tube. There's binder in the material, there's water in the material. That leads to the fact that we create sticky material. In the process chamber itself, while pelletizing, this is the benefit. On the discharge tooth, that could lead to problems. So we done everything possible to create a really smooth discharge tooth in order to avoid sticking of materials on the tooth. In the process chamber, we can see the honeycombs, spread iron, which leads to the effect that materials get into the honeycombs and there is no movement of material and the bottom layer itself. So there is a natural bottom layer, which leads to a natural wear protection. As we discussed, material, binder, water inside the process chamber could stick in the process chamber as well. So there is a need to add scrapers in the process. See over there, three scrapers are for the bottom layer cleaning and one scraper is for the cleaning of the rim itself. Sure, of course, you can see the hose where the water is added into the process chamber. We can change the position of the nozzles, mainly done while commissioning. As well, the inclination and the position of the scrapers could be changed. That leads to the fact to improve the process, to create a really smooth process.